their quad as being an essential component. My first act, uh, one year ago tomorrow indeed, uh, was after being sworn in as Prime Minister was to fly to Tokyo uh, to represent Australia uh, in Japan at the second uh, Quad Leaders Summit. And I will never forget the very warm and generous uh, welcome that I had uh, after my election. I can't think of any better way uh, to begin a Prime Ministership than a gathering of such important friends from our region. Uh, one year on, I'm absolutely delighted to be amongst close friends again here in Japan to continue our important work, standing together for an open, stable, secure and prosperous Indo-Pacific region. A region where sovereignty is respected and all countries, large and small, benefit from a regional balance that keeps the peace. Respect for the leadership of regional institutions, including ASEAN, the Pacific Island Forum and the Indian Ocean Rim Association, is central to our approach. And our vision statement that we will release tonight sets out the principles for our engagement in the region. Through the Quad's positive, practical agenda, we are taking action to address shared challenges. Together, we are leveraging our collective strengths and offering support to the region, which will be enhanced by the outcomes that we hope to agree on tonight. Uh, so thank you, everyone, for gathering. And I will now uh, hand to Prime Minister Modi uh, for his opening comments. Your Excellencies, Prime Minister Albanese, Prime Minister Kishida, and President Biden. I am very pleased to be taking part in this Quad Summit today and to be among friends. The Quad Group has established itself as an important platform for peace, stability, and prosperity in the Indo-Pacific. There is no doubt at all about the fact that the Indo-Pacific region is the engine for global trade, innovation, and development. We agree that the security and success of the Indo-Pacific is important not just for this region but for the entire world. We are moving forward with a constructive agenda based on shared democratic values. Through our shared efforts, we are giving a practical dimension to our vision. Strategic technologies, reliable supply chain, health security, maritime security, Counter terrorism, Jaise Mahatopur Kshetro Me, Hamara Sakaratmak Sayog Badraha Hai. Kai Desh or Samu, Apni Indo Pacific Randiti or Bijan Ki Gosha Karahe Hai. Aaj Ki Hamari Batak Me, Is Pure Kshetra Ke Samavesi or People Centric Vikas Ke Jude Vishopar, Charta Karnega, Ausar Milega. Meramana Hai. कि क्वाड वैश्विक भलाई मानव कल्याण शांति और समृद्धि के लिए निरंतर प्रयास प्रयत्न करता रहेगा प्रधानमंत्री अल्बनीसी को इस समिट की सफल अध्यक्षता के लिए अभिनंदन और बधाई देता हूं 2024 में क्वाड लीडर समिट का आयोजन भारत में करने में हमें खुशी होगी well, thank you very much, Prime Minister Modi. I now turn to Prime Minister Kishida. Hey. Eh, 
、安全保障環境は一層厳しさを増しています。法の支配に基づく自由で開かれた国際秩序が脅かされていますこうした厳しい情勢の中だからこそ我々が一堂に会し国際社会を分断,分,断分断と対立ではなく協調に導くという目標に向けて自由で開かれたインド太平洋フォイップという共通のビジョンへの強固なコミットメントを改めて国際社会に示す意義は極めて大きいと思っています。地域諸国とともに歩むことなしに、フォイップは達成しえません。We will listen to the voices of regional countries of the ASEAN, South Asia, and Pacific Island states to engage in practical cooperation which delivers true benefits to the region as a force for good. I hope today's discussion will give us another momentum to further spur our efforts. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Prime Minister Ji. And now I will give the floor to Mr. Biden. Well, gentlemen, uh, Prime Minister, I, uh, Prime Minister Albanese, especially for your impressive leadership of the Quad this year and your gracious flexibility in holding the meeting here uh, again in Japan. The, uh, you know, uh, while our Setting today is different, and our our mission remains the same, and that is to advance our vision of a free, open, secure, and prosperous Indo-Pacific,、uh, and、uh, and to demonstrate the capacity of democracy the Pacific,、uh, and、uh, and to demonstrate the capacity of democracies to deliver, to deliver on a shared in a shared region. I think people are going to look back at this,、uh, the Quad, and、uh, God willing,、uh, 10, 20, 30 years from now, and say it changed the dynamic not only of the region but the world. And uh, while, uh, while the setting today is different,、um, uh, you know, in our last two years, we made enormous progress, in my view. We're now launching a new initiative to keep that progress going. From projects to build secure telecommunications in the Pacific region, to strengthen our cooperation in submarine cables,、uh, new joint efforts between our private sectors to invest in infrastructure and clean energy projects in the region. And I'm also proud that of the work we've done、uh, with our partners, <coughs> the、uh, the ASEAN and Pacific Islands.、Uh, matter of fact, I was with、uh, one of our. Counterparts today at the larger meeting, and、uh, he's part of the ASEAN、uh, countries. And he said, "I think the Quad is a very good idea." Remember, in the beginning it was how it was going to be greeted, but and so it, it's it's a, it, I, I feel good. I think a, a great deal of the future of our world is going to be written here in the Indo-Pacific, and、uh, together I think we're going to continue to assure that. The, Future provides more opportunity, prosperity, and stability than anything else. So I want to thank you again for your strong partnership and friendship, and I apologize again for the change in plans. But thank you for accommodating this, and、uh, I look forward to our conversations tonight. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. President.、Uh, we will now move to a close.